I am going to make a trash can for a doll using plastic water bottles, a grocery bag, tape, craft paint, and glue. I start by removing the label from a water bottle. Trim off the top, begin painting the inside with craft paint. For the areas that are hard to reach, I found it a little easier to pour the paint in and then just move the container. Allow it to dry between coats, then continue painting. Painting on the inside reduces the chances of scratching off the paint and gives a nice new shiny trash can. But we would like ours to look a little bit worn, so we paint a thin coat on the outside, then we lightly dry brush it with black paint. Cut the bottom off of another water bottle, cut a small strip off of the water bottle to make a handle. Glue it on top, paint it, then place it on top of the trash can. Cut a rectangle out of a plastic bag, fold it, and tape the ends together to make a tube. Tie one of the ends closed, then place it into the trash can to be the bag. Turn another bag inside out, then stuff it with scraps of paper, tie the other end so the dolls have something to put in their new trash cans. Or paint a bottle blue. Once dried, turn it over, glue on beads to make a barrel. And you're done. Happy crafting! Here is a fun find. We found these pencil holders at Target for only a dollar and we thought they would make great trash cans for a doll. But our most favorite fun find comes from a tip on Facebook. Thanks to Baking Page and Digital 5 Angel. Want to give a shout out to Baking Page and Digital Five Angel. What's up? Wow, those cookies were so fabsome. Fabsome? Oh yeah, it's just something that you know Chloe and I say. Sophie, did you eat all of the cookies? Oops, I guess I did. Oh no, are you about to give me a lecture on the importance of not eating Grandma's cookies on the way to Grandma's house? No, don't worry about it. Really? Like, no lecture? None at all? Relax, Sophie. Besides, I know a great place where we can stop and get more on the way. What a serendipitous turn of events.